Find a dream that's worth your life. Our morning message on seeking what dream is worth your life, based on 1 Corinthians 9 25 to 26. The right dream focuses your energy. And we all could use more focused energy, right? It seems harder and harder to find these days. By now you've learned that you can't do everything. But not everything is worth doing, some things are more important than others. God doesn't expect you to do everything. So you shouldn't expect yourself to be able to do everything. Smart selection is key. You have to decide what matters and what doesn't, what dream is worth your life, and what dream is not worth one second of your life. Did you ever dream about being famous? Or maybe the best in the world at something? Or the richest person you know? Those dreams are not worth a moment of your life, because they are fleeting. One minute you could be a hero, and the next minute, you're a zero. One minute you're on the cover of some magazine, and the next week it's in the trash. Going after trophies is a foolish goal. Why? Because, given enough time, all your trophies are going to be thrown away by someone in this generation or the next. Don't live your life for trophies and world records and fame. Those are not big enough dreams. You need a dream that impacts eternity. That kind of dream focuses your energy and helps you endure. The Bible says in 1 Corinthians 9 25 to 26, that an athlete does everything possible to win a fight. When you choose God's dream for your life, you become purpose driven. You're not like a boxer practicing by punching the air. When you punch, you do it to score. You're not just playing around with your life. God's dream focuses your energy so that you can run straight to the goal he has set for you. When you run with that kind of effort, you won't waste a second of your life. I am truly glad you spent time to view this message. I hope you are blessed and share this with somebody else. Thank you, and have a great day everyone.